I'm here at the uh, Detroit River down on Alter Road. It's a great fishing spot. Getting ready to do a uh, video on um, sterile uh, mask making, sterile mask making. Okay, so anyway, this is just on the fly. If I want to get it out there, get this thing done. So, um, I guess to make it sterile, probably should have on some gloves or something. And so this is going to be um, to make a mask so that you can um, give them out, sell them, whatever. But people need to know that the mask that they're getting has only been used once. So this is impromptu. So we don't know what to expect within this video, but I'm still going to go ahead and do it. All right now. So anyway, these are rubber gloves. And as before, we use uh, two sheets of uh, paper towel. So this is bounty paper towel. The wind's blowing a little bit, so we gotta be careful here that it don't blow away. Then we use um, a piece of tissue between um, the two sheets of uh, paper towel. All right. The wind is not my friend at this time, but it's all good. We'll get it done one way or another. Diet will be done, it's Sunday, so diet will be done. <laughs> On earth as it is in heaven. Forgive us this day, <laughs> our daily bread, as we forgive those that trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation. But anyway, back to the video. So um, yeah, this is number 14, um, copper like i said before copper bends better than um steel so we'll cut off a little piece here for the nose part of it you don't really need much i'm gonna go shorter today so it don't take much so um we got two sheets a bounty got the tissue in the center now we're gonna roll this thing here we're gonna roll it like you would do a cigarette or whatever your pleasure might be but you want to get a little roll in there Get thing, that thing in there to look like whatever they call it. I'm trying to be careful with my words because they'll cancel a video if you say something that they don't like. So you can't use street terms or something like that. So I don't want to get bounced off for that because I have been um, videos deleted for language or content or something. So anyway, so I got that rolled in there like a cigarette. So uh, the next step is to lock it in place. So to do that, I'm gonna use this stapler. So I have a stapler, I'm a staple. So I bend it here to know where the end of the uh, metal is, to know where the staple is at. So I'm gonna do that. Try to eyeball it, make sure I get it right. Got it, got one good. Do it on the opposite end to lock it in place. Got that one, not so good, but it's in there. So then on the bottom part of this, we're gonna do everything in threes today. Threesies, trifecta, triple. Father, Son, Holy Spirit, three monkeys, and threes today. Okay, so I'm gonna do this one, two, three. So I did that three. I'm gonna staple this. Of course, you know, I'm stapling this in the center to have balance within the mass. And on this end here, we're gonna do threes over here. But better yet, let's back up. We need to um, get some other stuff going here for the straps. So, um, you know, I'm using rubber bands now. So this is 12 inch. So I'm gonna cut this in half. I'm gonna attach that on to the uh, Velcro. So I found out that the uh, Velcro was too uh, flimsy to handle and the uh, rubber band gave it more uh, grip. So that's half of a 12 inch. And this is the uh, Velcro. So it comes in strips, it comes attached together and you break off what you need. So it uh, comes in little sections here. I'm gonna do it in black. It's a different color here. Today I'm doing it in black. Okay, I got one piece out. Uh, this is trying to give me trouble today and I'm on camera. Wouldn't you know it? 
but we're going to get it. Because so I'm determined. I don't give up. I may give out, but I won't give in. Okay, so anyway, got one piece here. Got another piece here. So, um, what we're going to do is um, attach the Velcro to it. So now, the side that we're going to put it on is the non-sticky side. So the smooth side should be on the outside. So I'm going to attach it to this end here. Or is it this one? No, this one here. So what I'm going to do is staple this. Staple this rubber band onto the Velcro. sticky side and the smooth side is on the outside you have to just kind of pay attention to make sure you get it straight so that the velcro would be able to uh, stick when you uh, want to attach the mask to your face but one thing about this rubber band is that once you get it on you get it locked in place then you got some room to play with it say if you're pulling it down from your nose or whatever for whatever reason you got some play in there some stretch to be able to do that okay so we got this side here set up so anyway, um, the Velcro I had blew on the floor, on the ground. So I'm gonna grab another piece for the sake of keeping this video going. So I got another one. Okay, so we back to the threesies. So we almost done here, as a matter of fact. So, um, for the threes, we're gonna do, um, this is one, one turn here, two, and then three. Now we're gonna do this other end over here with the threes also. So we got one here, two, three. Then from there, we're gonna bring it all in. So we're gonna do um, cleats. So we got one here. You can do these any size you like. Today I'm doing it this size because it just turned out that way. So I got all this folded up in here together. So now what I'm gonna do is staple the, the Velcro onto it. Now we gotta make sure we know what we're doing because we gotta make sure that the sticky side sticks on the other side over there. So um, let's just double check it. What they say, um, measure twice, cut once. So this is the smooth side here. So then this side here will stick onto it. So you can test it first to make sure. So we see that's there. So we good. We just need to have it in this position, like this. And then from there, we're going to use this um, 215 sheet stapler. Um, I think it's called Boshed It. We got it on Amazon. It's like $40. So um, it's like goes through a whole lot. I don't have the staples out, but they're about that much. It's about like... Um, a pretty good thickness, enough for this anyway. I'm not gonna get into uh, a whole lot of detail right now. Just crank out this mask thing here and we're gonna make it sterile. So I got it somewhere in here and I'm gonna um, just go ahead and staple this. And this stapler will go through all this. Just gotta line it up correctly and we'll be good to go. The staple, the staple, you have to press down real good to make sure it goes through. Okay, so we got that side taken care of. Now we're gonna do the same thing over here in threes. So we got this here, we're gonna do one, two, three. So we're gonna do the bottom one the same way. So we got one, two, three. Then we're gonna bring it in Pour them, um, pleats, whatever it's called. We're gonna bring it in. I think you can see me doing this here. Bring it in, bring it together. So see that? We got that little pocket thing going on. Enough room for your lips to be able to move. Okay, so moving right along. 
So we staple this here. We got the smooth side on the outside. We got the rubber on the inside. And we're gonna put this rubber band part right up in here. So this is what we got. We're gonna use our super duper stapler. Staple this thing. And we almost there. We almost there, fans. I believe today is um, August the 23rd. Beautiful day here in Detroit. Another beautiful day. Can't beat summers here in Detroit on the water and whatnot. Soon, you know, maybe we'll be out there on the boat. Okay, so we got that done. Okay, now, so pretty much the mass is done. Now, up here, we're gonna put the bend in there for the nose. So just get to the center there and just do that. You see that just. And now you got that, that triangle piece for the nose. So now you set there. Now, here's where the magic comes in there. You know, I started out using plastic. So um, I'll put this in here to hold it down so it won't blow away. So now for the sterile part, we're gonna use this cling wrap. I was using this before for the straps. So everything has a purpose within time. Timing is everything. So this is what's gonna make it sterile. Wind is blowing, so I have to be a little cautious here. So anyway, I'm just gonna wrap it around. If it wasn't windy, I could do this a little better, but we gonna improvise. We gonna make work with what we got. It's gonna be all right. Now, the sterile part is gonna come from taking this here the end of this plastic and what we're gonna do is put another staple in this. Now this is like, it took me a minute to come up with this, but I'm thinking this might be the answer to the question. Because pretty much you just wanna know that you're the first one to use the mask. So you saw I bunched together that um, saran wrap. So now I'm using two staples on this. So I got that side stapled in. Then I'm gonna bring it together on the other end here. So I'm just gonna bring it together, you know, kind of like twist it together to be able to make the staple. And I'm going to staple this end here. So now this is the sterile mass. So if you get one of these, and this is on here, then you probably kind of could believe that maybe it hadn't been used before. That would probably be the thinking that this is the first use. But if you get one of these and uh, it's not on there, then you know maybe you're not the first one to use it. So then this is your sterile mass. So now you can give these out. And if you like, you can uh, bring it on over. I don't have any on me, but um, take a piece of uh, scotch tape and like tape right there. Then from there, then um, you got it. I mean, you got packaging here. Like you can give these out, sell them, whatever, and everybody can be safe. Okay, so now you got that. So now we're gonna go in reverse and we're gonna go ahead and uh, try this thing on. So we move right on forward. People coming out, they're fishing. It's a beautiful thing. How you doing, sir? Hi, how you doing? Great, you been catching any fish out here? Well, I don't know, I haven't been out here. Okay, all right, I thought maybe you was out here well, yesterday, didn't Okay. But on this side, I don't know, I haven't been Oh, it'd probably be better over here. Yeah, All right, enjoy. Okay, I'm back to the mask making. So I did one, I pulled off by hand, but you know, you can take some scissors to do it or whatever. Whatever it takes, right, knife, razor, whatever beer hands. Okay, so now it was sterile, you know, as I was showing you. And from there, you can put it on. Let's do this. Okay, I'm up to 14 minutes, so there you got it. There you have it. There it is. 
So simple, so easy, right? I'm all in there. Design is great. The new nose piece really doesn't require that much adjustment. Okay, that's enough for now. We're up to 15 minutes. Have a great day and I see you next time. Hope this has been beneficial. Um, hope this helps out. Um, whatever. Be smart, you know, keep your mask on. Just assume everybody got it. That way we can all stay safe or safer or whatever. Okay, stay hydrated. Eat only God's creation. Uh, don't eat any food that's modified. And uh, we all do good. Okay, take care.